Hello and welcome to Grove Dodge. My name is Jasmine and today we're going to be looking at this 2015 Dodge Journey SXT in white. Under the hood, she's a 3.6 V6 Pentastar engine pushing out 283 horsepower. In the front here, we have your headlights, daytime running lights and signal lights and of course these fog lights down here at the bottom. Lots of tread left in these tires. They are aggressive winter Goodyear tires mounted onto a factory 17 inch rim. We have your painted imagine mirror door handles. Now your mirrors do defrost. You have your keyless entry, nice chrome badging, roof rack. Let me go grab the keys and I'll show you the inside. So on the key fob here, we have your unlock lock remote starts and panic. So I'll just go ahead and start her up for us. Perfect, and I'll also show you how that keyless entry works. You'll simply put the key in your pocket or your bag, run your finger over the handle here, and the vehicle unlocks for you. It's a very handy feature to have. Located inside, you have this gorgeous black cloth seating. Now the seats are manually adjusted. Located inside the door here, we have your power locks, power windows, and adjustable mirrors. Big compartment at the bottom of your cup holder. Let me just hop on in. We have your lights on the left hand side, your windscreen wipers on the back of the steering wheel, your voice recognition, Bluetooth and screen options, as well as your cruise control. Now she is a push a button start, so I'll just go ahead and fully start her up for us. So we have your trash control. We're currently sitting at 82,873 kilometers, so lots of life left in her, but do speak to one of our finance managers about any extended warranty that you may wish to purchase, just to make sure that you are fully covered. We'll just flick through a few of the screen options here using these buttons on the steering wheel. Right now we have your fuel economy, your vehicle speed, your trip information, your tire pressure, t vehicle information, messages, turn menu off, and then we are back to that fuel economy. If we go way up to the top here with the buttons for your sunroof, which is a great size at that. Located in the center here, you have a nice big touchscreen giving you your AM, FM, satellite radio, your CD and DVD player, your controls for your outlets your climate control features with your front and rear defrost. We have your navigation, phone, more with your rear entertainment settings, and of course, handy backup camera. A little bit further down here, we have your hazard lights, your front and rear defrost, as well as that trash control, your dual climate control features, your SD plugin, CD player, and DVD player your cup holders, and a great size center console, which also holds your auxiliary and USB plugin. Stick with me and I'll show you the rest. Now located in the second row here, you have that gorgeous black cloth seating throughout the vehicle. You have your pocket at the back of the driver's seat here. Let me just hop on in. If we just look up to the top here, we have your rear climate control features as well as your DVD screen, keeping everyone entertained in the back here. Located behind the center console, you have your 12 volt plug-in and 150 watts. Now the seating is a 60-40 split, the driver's side being the 40, it just means the seat does slide forward by itself, giving you easy access to clamber on into those two extra seats in the far back. And as soon as you're done, just slides and clips back into place like so. Now coming around the back here, you have rear parking sensors. These are just those little circles in the bumper here, they're going to let you know if you're getting a little bit too close to anything. Super easy to open up the boot. There's a lever on the right hand side. You can simply squeeze that and open it up, giving you tons and tons of cargo space. But of course, if you did want some more, you can easily drop this third row flat into the ground. Definitely a great size SUV, very well looked after. Give you another peek inside the back here. This middle seat does fold down. Just giving you those two extra cup holders. You have some nice floor mats as well. Keyless entry on the passenger front, as well as your power locks, power windows, and of course that manually adjusted seat. So if you'd like to take this Dodge Journey for a test drive, we're located at 200 St. Matthews Avenue in Spruce Grove, Alberta, and hopefully we see you soon. Take care.